Born on 11 December 1936, Haji Samsuri bin Ahmad was the fourth child of seven children. His father, Mr. Ahmad, worked at the Singapore Botanic Gardens. While Haji Samsuri was still in primary school, in primary seven at the time, his father passed away. He was given an ultimatum to either take over his dad's job or move out of the house they lived in at the Botanic Gardens. Ayah mula-mula saya kerja kebun dekat ini band stand sebahagian tanam hibiscus rosa chinensis hibiscus saja itu gardener saya itu pos saya laborers itu jam gaji saya cuma empat ringgit lebih satu apa ni satu bulan satu satu hari habis bayi itu terus saya pergi hibirium mula library dan library habis empat tahun terus pergi hibirium. Nah, itulah saya jawatan saya jam uh, plan kolektor. Uh, jadi sebulan gaji itu saya boleh tahanlah dalam uh, uh, dalam ser, uh, 1400 tu. Uh, tahun uh, post Januari uh, 1968. Nah, itu saya post uh, ni plan kolektor. Uh, itu gaji saya besarlah tu. Well, plant collectors was the post that was uh, created in the Botanic Garden Singapore during the colonial times because during that period, uh, the British was coming into Southeast Asia, so uh, Malay archipelago was the place for the spices and all the other tropical economic plants. Most of the plant collectors back then were Malays and they loved the adventure of going into the forest and be one with nature. So basically these people would have known some common information about parts that is usually used by the ancestors or things that were brought in from traders that they had used for their daily use or medicine or food. They were very uh, what you call it, in tune with the plants. It's almost as if they see the plant and it's like talking to them, that's what they say. It's like when I see the plant, they are talking to me and I can tell you what family it belongs to, you know, up to the species level, some of them. Macam buku lagi, botak ni berkawali, ya. Tiu nama ni orang putih sentimen ni Tenospora crispa. Family dia ni minus minus permisi. Common name itu apa ni berkawali. Itu untuk orang kena apa ni malaria kan, habis kena kencing manis, darah tinggi semua ya. Itu bagus tu. Tu makan tu bagus buat itu. Kalau orang kena kat malaria kan itu kalau masuk hutan ya bengkak dia, dia jenis ni macam sireh tapi batang menggerutu The knowledge that they had was like handed over from their ancestors and also through interaction with the locals around the, re the region they will be the one for fronting the uh, the botanists to talk to the local villagers and gain their trust by talking to the locals they can get information okay this flower is about 10 cm large fragrant you know, cream coloured or the fruit is edible, it's got red aerials. So besides name, they also know about okay, plant growing by the riverine areas or on clay soil or on high mountain limestone. Haji Samsuri's mentor was the late Professor Edward Connor, a man who had great passion for tropical botany. Haji Samsuri, who was then only 16, had a lot to learn from Professor Corner, who had been appointed as Assistant Director at the Singapore Botanic Gardens from 1929 to 1946. I was born in the Rambutin, 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 I was born in the saya keringkan dia bilang how to dry dia bilang sama dia tanya saya sekarang benda ni kering kalau kau pergi Singapura mesti busuk damage oh no problem sir okay tell me apa kau punya jalan saya bilang caku sir arang saya bilang abang kau bikin rack tu kan rack abang rack tu uh, space pun dah press tu kan ya saya taruh atas step by step satu satu step 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 abang tu caku arang kau dia panas ya nah, itulah Tapi nak kanan kiri nak tutup untuk saya kerana air. Kalau air keluar dia tak panas. Nah, itu saya jaga. Sepuluh ribu lebih yang itu saya jaga. Teruk saya jaga. Hey, Tuan Konan tanya sana, What is the name of plant? Sam, you must answer. You cannot, you don't know. You try. Try your best as soon as possible. Sir, 
Okey, so habis dia kasih saya, saya dapat pokok apa yang tinggi lah. Nama dia Podocarpus polystachius. Tingginya dekat lima, dekat seribu lebih lah. Dia, dia naik, saya sangsa, saya bukan orang pandai, saya sekolah Melayu. Tapi saya bukan Inggeris. Dia orang care about this, but you must learn very hard, dia tanya. Dia test saya, pergi hutan, dia test saya. Kona, perusahaan kona. Orang yang bengis. Tapi itulah, saya takutlah dia, tapi saya berani lah jangan. So they took initiative, even though they were not trained, well, well educated, some of them, but some were up to secondary school, maybe. So they they took the initiative because of interest and because they wanted to help their bosses and to. I can do it. <laughs> so, with their help, we were able to say, okay, this was what was growing in this region. And now, because of modern time and a lot of uh, habitat loss, we can also say, okay, these are what have been lost by in our region. So, in a way, it's, it's their, their knowledge and their skills have contributed to current understanding of uh, plants and flora of our, our region and also help to further conservation efforts on plants here. Even upon reaching his prime, his passion for plants never falters. He hopes to inspire others to share the same passion for plants and he welcomes anyone who wishes to learn from him. Tapi saya kasi tahu macam cucu saya semua di sekolah Memang very capable lah tu, susah lah tu, ni saintis Orang yang bekerja tempat saya, yang mesti ada Saya harap boleh take over saya lah, ambil tempat saya lah Sekarang saya dah tak ada kerja tu Tapi kalau tak tahu apa nama pokok dia, boleh jumpa saya, datang rumah InsyaAllah buku ada Buku dah tunggu, eh orang dah tunggu orang, eh buku tunggu orang Haji Samsuri's dedication and resilience in the pursuit of knowledge will inspire and motivate current and future generations to learn from his wealth of experience.